Hello everyone, welcome to another Way in Wednesday. This is week 29. Um, this week went much better <laughs> as far as diet than last, well, let's be fair. Um, I cheated Wednesday and Thursday. And when I say cheat, I mean like I'm going to the electric chair. That's how much I was eating. On Wednesday, Wednesday's usually cheat night, and it was anyway, even though I had plateaued, because, I mean, life's, life's short. So I think we had pizza that night. I might have had some um, Chinese dumplings, too. Something, I don't know. But it was a lot. And then the next day, um, Mark was home from work. He wasn't uh, feeling very well. So I came home, actually, to, to kind of see how he was doing and ended up taking the rest of the day off. So we kind of had a case of the, like, efforts, like, life sucks, what are we going to do, da, 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 da. and <clears throat> comforted ourselves uh, with spiritual nourishment vis-a-vis -vis McNuggets. So that, you know, that happened too. <clears throat> but going forward with that, I um, really tightened up for the rest of the week. So Friday through last night, it was 1,500 calories, one night might have been 1,600, tight. No effing around, no screwing around. It was just exactly what I was trying to um, get back on point. So it seemed, to, it seemed to help. It seemed to help this week. Uh, exercise was none, really. I did something to my hip again. Um, I mentioned in another video during weigh-ins that I had hurt my hip while I was working out with Mark. Um, this time it wasn't from that. I don't know exactly what I did. It kind of feels like it's going to pop out when I walk or if I put a lot of weight on it. So I've been kind of avoiding physical activity. I do walk to work every day. Um, but even that I'm treading lightly. I'm like, have this deliberate limp trying not to put weight on it. So the, no exercise this week aside from my usual to and from work, which combined comes to about 20 minutes a day. So, um, still here, just looking. Let's see what else we got. So that's that. Uh, the weigh-in. Last week I was 192, I believe. And that was a plateau from the week before. Uh, I got on the scale right before I got into shower and shaved. And I was... I was just below 190. But I'm a rounder, so I'm going to say it was 189.8 like or something. So I'm going to say 190. We're going to keep it, you know, sane. So that's a two pound loss. So after a week of plateauing, and the previous few weeks, I think I only lost like a pound at a time. So to lose two is pretty good. So I am happy with that. You're gonna have to forgive me. I gotta pull these down because I can't see a thing. And if you notice my eyes darting, it's because I had to buy a new phone because I smashed my other one, not in a rage or anything, but um, I had dropped it on indoor outdoor carpeting from about a foot and a half off the ground and the whole thing smashed. So, um, the picture might be clearer, but I'm going to have to get used to looking around the screen. I think it's over there where I'm making eye contact. Probably. I don't know. Um, so that was good on the weight. Uh, two pound loss puts me at 190. When I started this journey, I was 272. And when I started the channel, I was about 230. So since I started the channel, I've lost about 40 pounds. So actually now, if you go back to some of my earlier videos, you'll probably see a little bit of a difference in um, the face, uh, like around here. Not so much anywhere else because I didn't do any body shots. So um, I did dig up a couple of old pictures from like last Christmas. So I'll probably um, at least use that as the thumbnail, if not some other stuff, where I was closer to like 270, 280. So um, I'll be digging those up and posting those soon. Um, the non-scale victory is another notch on the belt, so I'm six notches in, which is pretty cool, and it's not, I could probably go seven or eight, but it's not on principle that I'm trying to do it. I'm not trying to just jam myself into these things. I comfortably and for necessity wear it on the sixth notch, so that's good for me. Um, I didn't take down last week's video. If anybody <laughs> saw, um, the way in because there was a plateau, there was nothing to report, so I did an update on loose skin, and I stripped down, which to me felt almost naked. I was wearing uh, shorts and a, a wife beater, like a tank top, and pulled and yanked at the parts of my body um, on camera. So that was a risk I took. I've, of course, watched the video myself over again a few times, 
and I was kind of happy with the way it came out. Again, I'm surprised I didn't take it down out of either shame, fear, or whatever. Uh, if you get a chance, check it out. It's uh, Way In Wednesday 28. So, also I think I titled it Loose Skin Couture. It is, you know, it's what it is, so. Um, and I guess one more thing that shows progress. I'm starting to show some wrinkles here and there. These have always been there. I have permanent creases. But um, some other spots they're showing up. That just means there's less stuff under the skin, which is good. It means more weight off the body. Um, but I have a lot of other risk factors for wrinkles. I don't drink a lot of water. Um, and I smoke. So it's not news to me that this is, you know, going to be part of my reality. Um, you know, it doesn't bother me, really. I'm just noticing, is all. So that's pretty much it. Not too much uh, going on in the upcoming week. We were supposed to get a lot of snow today, and then we were supposed to get a little snow today, and then we got next to no snow today. So <clears throat> there will be no digging out or anything like that. Um, Easter's coming up next weekend, so Holy Week will be starting. My family's uber Catholic, so there'll probably be cards and ham and hyacinth uh, and all that stuff coming up. And uh, I don't know, we'll just see where the week goes. So far, so good. This week has been um, better than the last. Um, send thoughts and, and happy well wishes to Mark. He's been having a rough time lately. So thank you for tuning in. Subscribe, uh, hit the like button, and I'll catch up with y'all soon.